suppose, Garrett, the first question that we need to dive into is just how are people struggling right now? You uh, clearly at Monies have been uh, seeing people uh, going through pretty tough times. What are the what are the biggest issues facing people uh, as we get through this summer and head into a pretty difficult winter? I mean, the key one is what's already been covered is the increasing costs. I mean, it's now feeding through to core costs around food and things like that. And it's it's an energy with the upcoming further increase in the energy cap. So, you know, it's now around how do people actually manage their limited the money they have and actually get it to go as far as they can. You know, managing, budgeting, really carefully allocating their money so that they can get the essentials. I mean, that's you know, it, it's tough and it's hard and it's actually just helping people to do that. And I suppose when we're looking at this issue, there are two sides to the coin. There's potentially what the government should or could be doing, but also what us as individuals could be doing ourselves. And I suppose at the end of the day, it's got to be a bit of both. What are the big recommendations that you might have for, frankly, both individuals, but also the government? I mean, government, we've heard some of the things around taxes and and helping helping put money into people's pockets. I think in terms of individuals, it is really that simple one of re- obviously looking to see where you can save, you know, switching utilities where you can. But importantly, things like getting onto direct debit plans versus, you know, prepaid meters if you can, because they're cheaper. But budgeting becomes more and more important. So really taking simple steps to understand spending, you know, potentially using what's called jam jar budgeting to kind of put money aside. You know, that's actually driving a higher use of cash, as the post office would have highlighted, um, you know, a, a few two weeks ago. But it can be done digitally as well. But I think a really important one is really watching carefully your credit score, your payments, and If you're worried about things, get in touch with your bank, get in touch with your provider because they have they have approaches and they have things to do. And burying your head in the sand is never is never actually the best answer because you'll be worrying about something. But your bank on your loan will actually may actually be able to help you um, before you actually get in trouble. Um, And I mean, that's a really key. That is a really key thing is just, you know, manage it and talk to people.